guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a What I Got For Christmas 2020. So before I start, I just want to clarify that I was really unsure about whether or not I was going to do this video. I was for ages planning on just not doing it because I thought it was really out of touch considering how tough this year has been for everyone in so many different ways. And I didn't want it to seem like it was just coming on here and being like, oh my gosh, guys, look what I got for Christmas. Everything's so perfect. Look at all my gifts because I'm aware that some people didn't get anything at all. They weren't able to see family. They weren't able to even give gifts or even have gifts to be given. So I don't know. I just really didn't want this to seem like out of touch and me bragging and showing off. So I asked on my Instagram if you guys wanna see this video and literally every single one of you said yes and it's a really nice distraction. So I just thought I'd go ahead and do it anyway but I wanna clarify that in no way am I trying to brag or rub in the things that I got into anyone's face. I'm aware that that is a classic I work got for Christmas. I'm not trying to brag or boast in any way, shape or form and then it kind of is. But we're here and I'm going to show you some of the fun gifts that I got. Hopefully you guys can get some gift inspiration if it's your birthday coming up or you need to get your friend a present, whatever it is. Here I am, I'm going to show you what I got for Christmas 2020. If you guys enjoy, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, turn on post notifications by clicking the bell and follow me on my Instagram and my TikTok. And let's get straight into the video. So first off, I'm going to start with some clothes that I got for Christmas. So the first clothes that I got were actually from a brand called Jaded London, which you guys are probably familiar with. They're a really cool brand. I've worked with them throughout this year and they sent me a little Christmas treat, which is so nice of them. So these clothes I'm going to show you are gifted. Hashtag ad gifted. Everyone always gets so confused when I put ad gifted and they think that I'm being paid for the ad, but really I just have to put that on anything that I'm given by a company, otherwise I'll get sued. So the first thing I got is this set that I've been dreaming about this whole year. I love this set so much. I'm in love with brown, orange, and earthy tones at the moment, and this is just insane. Look at it. It's kind of like the, you guys have probably seen this, but it's the velour brown jaded, um, little tracksuit sets so that's the top and then the bottoms these fit so nice kind of nice on the booty and we just love to see that i'm gonna go into 2020 with a nice peachy bum just kidding i actually don't have a bum they also sent me this little patchwork white top which i've seen all the tiktok baddies in this and i just thought i'd copy them because that's what i like to do <laughs> i got these jeans which are super fun. So thank you so much to Jaded London for those clothes. I cannot wait to sport those. Sport those? What the f Now to get into presents from my, actually I'm gonna start with my boyfriend because his present was really, really good this year. So this year he got me these Nike shoes. They kind of look like a mixture. I would describe them like a mixture between Air Force and Jordans and I'm in love with them. I don't actually have any black and white shoes like this, I'm pretty sure. And I, as you can tell, I've already like worn these to death. I love these, they go with any outfit. They're so cool and I haven't actually seen many people with these yet. He also got me some other stuff which I'm not gonna show in the video. <laughs> anyway, moving on to what my boyfriend's family got me. His mum really kindly got me two candles, one of which I had to leave with my boyfriend because I had too much stuff to take home and I didn't want to smash it because it was really delicate, but it was a lovely candle holder and it had like gemstones and stuff in it, which was so pretty. But she also got me this candle, which is so cute and it smells so fresh. I love the smell of this and I've already burnt it as you can see. I really, really love that, so thank you if you're watching this. And then Joe's sister got me the bath bomb and some soap with essential oils in it. Then for my best friend Phoebe, she got me a mug and I've already used it so ignore the coffee inside. But look how cute this is. It's got loads of pictures of us when we were like babies. Well not actual babies, but we were just really young. And I love it, so cute. And I've already drank my morning coffee out of this. Okay, now I'm gonna move on to presents from my immediate family. So my sister got me, <laughs> She actually got me the nicest presents this year and if I think about it too much, I'll probably cry. But she's a really good present giver. So the first thing that she got me is, ah, oh my God, this is just so cool. Um, a Hello Kitty blanket. Are you kidding me? Isn't this the cutest thing you've ever seen? It even has little butterflies all over it and it's just the perfect color scheme. I actually kind of want to put it on my wall as like a tapestry, but I don't think anyone else would appreciate that. So I might just keep it to my bed for now, but thank you so much that is. It's also so soft and I love it. Um, she actually also got me a big teddy. Oh my gosh, I love it. <laughs> this is so cute. If you guys don't already know, I am a 15 year old 
15 is actually way too old still. I'm an eight year old girl at heart. I don't know if it's because of the past trauma or I just still love teddies, but I have a lot of them. <laughs> when I say like, I actually, I actually have like a weird emotional connection to all of my teddies and I have a lot, so this meant a lot. This one is so cute. It's the perfect size for cuddles as well. I can kind of like straddle him and pretend that it's a human. Wait, that sounds, that sounds really creepy, but I don't mean it like that. But like, you can give her like a human sized hug. Also from my sister Izzy, she got me one of these things which you use when you're washing your face. And I actually needed one of these and I was gonna buy one when I was with her and she was like, she gave me the look of like, don't you dare buy that. And then I realized I'm probably getting one for Christmas. But she also got me a lovely little PJ top, which is like a satin pink. Very, very cute. And then this pink bra. Pretty. I really can't wait to wear this. It's so cute. She also got me this face roller, which is meant to be really good. It has, ooh, oh my gosh. It has like loads of little tiny spikes on it. This is so cool. I feel like this is going to be really good for my skin. I'm like a bit of a skin geek. I love like skincare stuff. I have like a very controlled skincare routine and if I don't do it, I get really stressed out. So I actually can't wait to add this to my routine. And then the last thing from my middle sister, Isabel. Hello Kitty, car mats. Oh my God, oh my God. Ah! <laughs> this is so cool. Oh, other way, other side, other side. Wait, what the hell? Where did you even get this from? They're so cool. So these two go in the back. Says her name right here. The queen herself. And then she got me these big ones which go like in where I drive. I can't wait. I really hope these fit in my car. I haven't actually checked yet, but either way, I'll make it happen. Thank you so much, Izzy. I love all of my presents and I love you lots and lots and lots. So now on to what my dad got me for Christmas this year. The first thing he got me is this crepe machine, which is such a thoughtful present because when we go to Endeavour and they have this crepe stall and we always get the crepes there and it literally is this exact machine. Like they have the little spatula thing that you go like that with and do the pancakes on top and I cannot wait to use this. But yeah, I feel like this was such a thoughtful present because obviously you thought about that and how I always stuff my face with craps when I'm down there. So I can actually now make my own, which I'm so excited about. And then he got me a easel for my painting. If you guys didn't already know, I love painting. Loads of the things in my room I've actually made myself. <laughs> Bit of an artist. I'm just kidding. I'm like really awkward about my work. When I put on my Instagram story and you're like, oh my God, Evie, that's so good. Can I buy it? I get like really awkward. I appreciate you guys telling me that my art is good because I get really shy about it. Anyway, what am I even saying? He got me an easel, which is so cool because you can actually like put it up and then fold it back down instead of like the wooden ones that just always stand up. This one is really practical and I can put it in this little bag and take it with me wherever I... Are you crying? He actually looks like he's crying. Are you okay? Is it there? Another present which I'm so excited to use is this um, leopard print yoga mat. I asked for this for Christmas because I always steal my dad's yoga mat. And also it's blue and boring. And now I have a really cute leopard one, so I cannot wait to use it. And also it's really thin, which is great because I can store it a lot easier. Another present that I got was this. Almost whacked my nose with that. I do not want to be paying for another nose job anytime soon. The next thing is this Revlon air dry brush. What is this called? It's called like the two-in-one. I have wanted this for the longest time. Basically it's like a mixture between a brush and a hair dryer so the air comes through here by the bristles and it makes it really easy to do like little flicks at the end and to blow dry your hair because I'm so bad. You know in the hairdressers when they have the brush and then the hair dryer and they do that little thing where they like go like this with the- I'm like how the f*** are you doing that? Like I don't get it. But hopefully with this it'll make it a lot easier to have nice blow dried hair and then this is one of my favorite things i got it's so so good i actually love it so much and it's the fiorucci deer jumper and as soon as this came out i was like i've got my eye on that i'm gonna manifest it and then it came on the black friday sale and i was like i can hear santa carlin <laughs> so i just got it from santa so thank you so much santa for this little jump i love it so 
It literally stinks of roast potatoes. Oh my god. The amount of roast potatoes I ate yesterday was actually uncalled for, but I'm no regrets. It was just the best day ever. Dad really kindly got me this camera lens, and I had no idea he was getting this for me because we were talking about it ages ago because I wanted this lens for the longest time. I got a new camera a while ago. I got the uh, Canon M50 because the big one, the big DSLR was just not doing it for me. It was just so big and chunky, and it was just like annoying to use, and the focus was, anyway, boring probably no one cares about the camera but the lens I have on there right now is like a fixed pancake lens so it doesn't zoom in or doesn't do any other depth of field it just has one fixed depth and this one is a zoom lens it goes directly on the m50 so you don't need the adapter it doesn't make it heavier or chunkier and I kind of wish to use this when I go traveling and do vlogs next year when I'm living up in Japan and Bali I'm gonna bring this with me and do some really good vlogs so yeah thank you so so much for that I really cannot wait to try that out and get some really good content for you guys on there and finally I'm gonna show you some little things I got in my stocking so the first thing is something that I sent my dad on Amazon because I've been seeing this book okay <laughs> I've been seeing this book on TikTok everywhere and I ordered it thinking it'd be a normal size book and look how small it is it's literally tiny. It's called A Practical Guide to... Oh, no, it's not. It's called The Four Agreements. I actually don't know what's inside it because I haven't read it yet, but I keep seeing people quoting it on TikTok. So I can't wait to read that. And then I got a hair clip. I love these hair clips so much. And this color is so cute. And I also got some stress balls, which I cannot... Dex is like... Mm -hmm. No. I have very fidgety hands and it's really annoying, especially when I'm anxious. I'll literally be like doing anything like <laughs> to like occupy my hands. So this is already, I have another stress ball, but my sister borrowed it for a day and then popped it. So I can't wait to have some more because it actually really helps with like anxiety and stress in general. Finally, I got some products that I use every single day, just like some top up products. So I got the CeraVe Smoothing Cleanser and the Ordinary Niacinamide 10% zinc no 10% niacinamide zinc 1% which I use every single day in my skincare routine and I actually ran out of both of these products literally three days ago so perfect timing so yeah that is everything that I got for Christmas 2020 I really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you actually want to go back and binge all my other work for Christmases and see how much I changed because I look so different I made a playlist of all of my Christmas hauls and yeah I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and had a wonderful day whether you celebrate Christmas or not or whatever your plans were I hope you had the best oh but yeah if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel and turn on post notifications by clicking the bell and follow me on my Instagram and my TikTok and for now I'll see you guys in my next video bye oh baby I love your madness it's so incredible